I found an AI platform that provides you with an entire AI software company. They have AI agents that perform the task of a product manager, data analyst, an engineer, architect, and even a team leader. You just have to provide what you need with just one sentence, and that's it. All of these different AI agents will talk to one another and create the project for you. In this video, I will use the platform to create a website, a blog, PPT, videos, and a lot more. So stay tuned till the very end. You can look at the timeline to go over any specific section. Now let's go on to my laptop and use our AI team to create different projects. Okay, so here we are on MetaGPT. The link will be down in the description box as well as in the pinned comments. And let's look at what they can do. So here MetaGPT claims on providing the first AI software company. Yes, they are claiming on providing an entire suite of AI agents, which does the work of a software company. So let's go over to MetaGPT which is the product and use it right in front of our eyes. So here, as you can see, we just have to provide our requirements in this text box and MetaGPTX will create everything from scratch for us. If you want to see what other people have built using MetaGPTX, just scroll down and you'll see Travel Planner, there's Gomuku, Pixel Game, there are some other things as well. And uh, yeah, it basically provides you with every single thing to build projects. Now here, what we will be doing is first build a website which contains all of my links. So for me as a creator, it becomes really difficult to manage all of my social media links, YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, LinkedIn, all of these things. So I need to build myself a platform which has all of these links listed down. So let's just click over here, link hub, and that's exactly what we will be building. It helps you build it using Vue and YAML. So those are perfect text tags for me. Let's try it out. So this is what I've written, build a link hub for me. Now, Alex is thinking, who is the engineer? Mike is the team leader, there's product manager, architect, data analyst, so on and so forth. Now, all of these AI agents will be talking to one another and try to build what I need. All right, so we are finally done with the creation. It took close to around five to 10 minutes and let's see what it has created. So here it's preparing the preview and this is exactly what I needed. Uh, I need to change the images and the links as well. But MGX has done a really good job in creating this website. Now this website is completely created by Alec and we can actually view the entire code for it as well. Now this is just the deployed version. We can deploy it as well. So in order to view the code, you can just click on editor and here you can see all of the code files that has been created using AI. Now let's just go back to the app viewer and ask it to add some of my images. So let me just add my image. So I've added the image, add this as my profile image on the website. Okay, let's see how it does. Okay, so Alex has been assigned the job to do this and it is trying to add the profile image to the website right now. You can even see which lines of code is Alex changing and you can actually see it over here. It's changing the profile.jpg over here in the app.view, which is actually perfect. So let's see the final output and how it looks like. Oh, and there you go. It has changed my image perfectly well. Now I can keep on chatting with it and keep changing the name, uh, the description, even the links as well. But I think you get my point. Apart from that, you can even deploy your entire website by just clicking on deploy and changing the deployment URL and then click on deploy. That's how easy it is to now share your entire website and the code with the entire world. By the way, all of these projects that I create here will be down in the description box as well as in the pinned comment. So you can go check it out. But now let's start with a new chat. In this part, I will create an entire blog website using our AI software team. So let's actually do that. Let me create the blog and let's ask the AI team to do it. Build a blog using Astro. So it will be using Astro in order to create the entire blog. It will actually code everything right from scratch and give us the final output within a few minutes. So let's wait for a few minutes and see the final output. Okay, this was faster than I expected. This actually took just around one to two minutes to create the entire project. 
So let's look at what it has created. This is my blog and this is the home page. We have the blog page where I believe the blog should be there. Okay, they are there using MDX, Meta GPT in production. So it has written some of its own blogs for now and we can even write our own blogs. It has also created an about section which I was not expecting and it also has links to Twitter and GitHub. Now, of course, I need it to be my blog. So it can't be Meta GPT blog. We need to edit it completely. So Okay, so I've given it some instructions. Let's see how it performs and if it is able to change the entire blog and customize it according to my needs. Okay, so it has done all of the steps. I've marked Alex's task as completed, changed the title, created blog posts and removed unrelated topics. So let's see if it has worked. So let's see if it has worked properly. So over here, I can see the title has been changed to Ali Solanki's blog. All of the topics have also been changed. AI revolution in e-commerce, exactly what I wanted. My tech startup journey, future of AI, so on and so forth. So I think it has done a pretty decent job at converting and customizing the entire blog. Now, of course, I can keep asking it to change the structure, but this essentially puts the entire blog to an automated machine. You can start generating unlimited number of blogs using MetaGPTX. So we've developed a link tree as well as a blogging website right from scratch, all within just a matter of few minutes. Now let's look at what else can we do within the span of this video. So let's click on new chat and let's see if it can create us an entire PPT from scratch this time. So let's say uh, create an entire PPT on AI and e-commerce topic. Okay, so this will be created using view and slide dev. So let's ask it to create this entire PPT in view and slide dev. Let's see how it does. Okay, so Alex has created the entire PPT for us and you can view it over here. Uh, AI and e-commerce, okay, it has done exactly what I wanted. Uh, there are table of con contents as well, okay. Can we click over it? Okay, we can. We can actually click over it and go to each of the slides. Perfect and I can control it using my uh, keyboard as well. Introduction to AI, key AI applications. So yes, it has created the entire presentation for us and it is actually a website. We can deploy it and share it with our friends, with whoever we want. And this is actually quite amazing. We can even edit the entire code with the editor. So if you're a developer, you can actually just go over here and start editing the details or ask Alex, who's your engineer, to do all of these things for you. Now I can see that we can even create videos using React and Remotion. So let's see how it does with React. We've not tested it out yet. So let's see what type of a video is created by MGX for us over here. Oh, perfect. We have the entire video with us. Let's play it out and see how it does. So it's a remotion video and then there's edit and save to reload. Okay, perfect. So let me just change certain things about this. Now, I don't want this particular logo over here and I want to change it to something of mine. So let me just add an image and see if it can animate that. So this is one of my images and let's see if it can replace the image and use this instead. Okay, let's see if it can use this image instead of the one that is already provided in the video. So something crazy just happened. So right now the image was not loading. The logo that I had added, this particular one, was not loading. So I asked my AI software team to fix that issue and it did. Uh, it actually went ahead and solved the issue for me. It went inside the code and solved it for me. And let's see how the video looks like now. So it has changed the logo. It is showing every single thing over here and the video is ready to go. We can even ask it to change complex things. We can ask it to change text. We can add new images, new videos, and it will do every single thing for us. And the best part is this is actually on a website. So I can actually just copy the URL 
and paste it over here and the entire thing is on a website so it has created an entire website for us and we can actually view it live right now so say for example if i want to share my videos with my editor he can actually view it here now another amazing feature about meta gptx is that it actually integrates really well with superbase yes you can connect superbase which is an open source alternative to firebase you can connect it right over here and have your entire backend connected with it you can even create cool projects and share it with the app world so you can actually just click over here post it on app world and everyone would be able to see what you've created you can just save it and created a video animation and save and post so that's how easy it is to start sending it to the app world for everyone to see now if you want to use meta gptx and try the platform by yourself then go click the link in my description box as well as in the pin comments and you can start right off and if you are interested in more such videos of leveraging tech and building businesses then just subscribe to this channel because i keep posting a lot of videos on it i'll see you in the next one bye bye